Hi everyone, my name is Ellen and this is a tarot reading for Capricorn for August. And we're gonna start with tarot rider white cards. Uh, three cards from here. We'll see what the universe will bring. What energy is gonna be around. I hope you all having a great summer so far. Coming quickly. And the first card is Page of Wands. Uh, Page of Wands uh, will say you might have uh, new ideas, mm, new business ideas, uh, or you might mm, be dealing with your kids. Maybe it's half term, so you're gonna be thinking uh, how to spend time, how to what to do, um, how to entertain them. Or you might hear from them that um, if they come back from uni uh, or you haven't seen them long ago. So you might hear any um, messages, uh, phone call. So, or it could be, like I said, some new, <clears throat> just a new idea. is uh, six of swords six of swords it's card of progress cards of movement um, uh, card of change for the better if you had some crisis if you had some issues some problems so you moving away from them towards uh, something new some brighter future to the different shores let's say so this is a movement towards a new life uh, also this card uh, can mean uh, literally moving moving houses moving countries um, maybe you decide to move in different and live in different country maybe you gonna be Maybe you have a new idea that you want to move uh, to different country. Maybe work related, you're gonna have to move to different country. But um, uh, this card, or oh, like I said, which is like moving house. Um, also, you might have a small travel and but anyway, this card is um, card, like I said, card of progress, uh, card of moving forward, everything for the best. Um, move ahead, or maybe you gonna evolve uh, yourself constantly. Maybe you studying and you always on the move, always on the go. Right, one more card from here is Knight of Wands. Yeah, you're definitely gonna be on the move, the, and you're gonna have uh, fast decisions, fast actions. You here on fire, you unstoppable. You take, you grab your idea, and you um, acting on it. So yes, if you. If you had idea to 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 move move house or country, you will uh, gonna go for it. You would definitely uh, this is gonna be like okay, yes, decision is made. I'm doing it because this is a confident person. Mm, doesn't um, this card say don't be scared uh, to take any risks. <clears throat> And here you want everything uh, fast, quickly, and now. So, and you're gonna mm, uh, act on it, but also means could be again uh, some could be trip, not very far away, but also could be a uh, travel plans. You might be thinking to travel. Uh, next deck, we're gonna use the Dark Mansion Tarot. 
three cards from here. And here we have nine of swords. <clears throat> uh, nine of swords. Uh, card of fear. Uh, fear and regrets. Maybe uh, you're gonna feel scared um, and regret your decisions about, like I said, about this move, about um, uh, you gonna be scared or, or what is waiting for me ahead. You might even be so worried, so stressed that might even lose the sleep, might have a nightmares, might have problems to sleep because all these thoughts are going to be constantly on your mind, keeping you awake. Um, what did I do? Did I make the, uh, the right decision? What's waiting for me next? <clears throat> but here this card would say it's all in your head. You need to uh, move on from it as soon as, you, as soon as possible, as soon as you can. Uh, because again, you might beat yourself uh, for for your decisions. Uh, all of a sudden, it hit you that oh maybe that was too fast. Uh, we'll see. <clears throat> and here we have seven of cups. Next, yes, uh, seven of cups would say to us that focusing on one thing, not at a million things at the same time. Uh, focus on, on one thing and you're going to be fine. Uh, ex decide for yourself exactly what you want, what you need. Uh, don't don't uh, lose yourself in, in illusions uh, and imagining. No, you should uh, see clear only on one thing. Uh, to have uh, some sort of one target, one plan, and stick to it. Not millions of, oh, maybe this, maybe that. No, um, for you it's easier to uh, focus on one thing at a time. You um, achieved one thing, what you wanted, what you planned, then you can move on to the next, and so on, and so on. Uh, so constantly put... Uh, targets uh, for yourself, put, um, make an achievements for yourself. Not 10 things at the same time, you're not gonna uh, get anywhere far uh, this way. And we'll see one more card from here. Nine of Pentacles. Well, like I said um, just now, if you keep focusing, now, on one thing at a time, you're going to be uh, rewarded very well. Uh, Nine of Pentacles, so that's a very great um, money-wise card, so you should have no issues. You're going to be very well rewarded uh, for your hard work, for your concentration, for your focus. And you're going to enjoy this reward. You might um, go and treat yourself. You might treat yourself to a spa. You might treat yourself to um, some um, uh, spending some time at the countryside uh, or somewhere at the nature, at somewhere in a beautiful uh, uh, place, beauty spot. Maybe you're going to have a, a beauty day. Maybe you go shopping. Whatever you like, uh, you're going to treat yourself. You're going to enjoy the money. You're going to enjoy your reward and you're going to be proud of it. And you, because you done it all yourself, you uh, achieved it all by yourself, so you have uh, every right to enjoy it by yourself. Or if you want to take somebody, that's great. And one more deck, we're going to use Arcano. It's a new, uh, new deck, very nice cards. We'll see what they say. <clears throat> and we're having the wheel. Uh, 
So the wheel again represents could be travel, could be all your wishes are coming true, uh, and also the life changing uh, card, uh, karmical card. Mm. Uh, it's a new beginning. Um, it's your dreams will come true. Or again, traveling, uh, traveling somewhere far away, traveling, traveling the world. Well, we'll see what this will take us, which way it will turn. Because the wheel, it's very tricky card. It could go both ways. But it's good to have this wheel in balance, like everything in life. And we having the hanged man, another high rank card. The hanged man uh, say, saying to us that it's time to take a pause and it's time to don't force it. Any, uh, anything you want um, in business, <clears throat> in relationship, in other things. No, you need to pause it and let it go with the flow. Uh, it will uh, all work out when it's time. Now, maybe it's time to uh, think about your path ahead. Maybe to rethink uh, what you want in life. The universe give you another chance, but this uh, this is part of some kind of stagnation. Stagnation and a project might be frozen or stopped at the moment. It feels like now the cards say don't do anything, especially don't rush. Uh, one more card is Justice. Another high rank. So you have three high rank cards in a row. Uh, <clears throat> one after another. So Justice is a card of balance as well. Like I just said, you don't rush. Everything, this wheel needs to be, uh, this wheel needs to be, uh, Hold in balance uh, in order to uh, work in your benefit. And justice uh, will say to us uh, that she doesn't care about anything. You will get what you deserve. Uh, the justice will work its way through. Um, everybody will get what they deserve. Even if you have any anything in court, if you have any issues in court, and if you have any issues, um, some dispute with somebody, uh, here the justice will say that uh, the person who's right, who done the right deeds, will be paid off, rewarded. Who done the bad can be punished. So the justice have your eyes closed. She doesn't all she see, she only see justice and uh, balance. So uh, here I would say that you don't um, You don't have any say, you don't have any, you can't fix the situation. Uh, time will put everything right in place and everything will, will work out how it should be. <clears throat> very interesting, very important months for you, I would say. And now we have the light seer tarot, so three cards from here. Let's see. And we have six of pentacles. 
<laughs> another card of balance. Uh, so balance, balance your emotions, balance your finances. And this card, again, like just like justice, uh, say you're gonna get what you deserve. You're gonna get what you you have given. And this card also will say that it's good to do some charity work. It's always pays off that if we, I don't know, give one coin, we, we're getting three times more back always. So if you have resources uh, and you can have help somebody financially, it's a great time to do that. Uh, if don't, you can also um, give uh, your resources and help somebody um, by just giving your time. Um, time is most precious res uh, resource we all have. Uh, this is our life. And if you dedicate this to the benefit of some other person, this is very valuable. Um, you should always remember this. So here, like I said, you're going to get what you give. So keep everything in balance and maybe um, keep an eye on your finances to keep them also in balance. One more card from here is Seven of Pentacles. <clears throat> Seven of Pentacles will say to us that uh, your hard work will pay off, you will uh, see your benefits, you will see your dividends, you will see your harvest. Um, but a little bit later, maybe late, um, not as soon as you hoped or wish for, uh, you might need to wait a bit. So more like in autumn time or even seven months from now, uh, whatever you are working on and keep wor working. Don't give up, don't um, uh, don't stop if you if you still don't see any rewards, keep working. Uh, it will definitely pay off. You will see your reward for your hard work just a little bit later. It will take a little bit longer maybe than you you hope. And one more card from here is Six of Wands. <clears throat> Six of Wands, great card, card of triumph, uh, the card of victory. So whatever you uh, were fighting for, you will win it. You hear you are a winner, uh, you are a performer, maybe you decide to work on the stage, maybe you decide to do a public uh, speech or you're going to work on the public. Here people going to support you and going to applaud you. They're going to receive you very well. You're going to be uh, having time of your life. You're going to enjoy it. You're going to be star of the show, star of the performance. You would love it every second of it. And you're going to be very well received. So maybe you have some projects um, coming up um, where you have to speak up or show up publicly. They're going to uh, work great. Uh, maybe you're going to uh, open some internet project this is gonna work out also great I'm gonna be well received very great reading what uh, can I say very important let's see what the angels gonna say to us what message did they have have confidence a great message, especially at the last, uh, for the last, um, yes, if you're not sure, uh, have confidence. It's going to work out great for you. Uh, moving forward does not necessarily require you to have confidence in yourself. Confidence in God is enough, along with knowing that God works through you and with you in all ways. Lean upon us 
if your confidence uh, weavers and we will beyond your courage and faith great message yes uh, if you're not sure you can be always be sure that God angels and universe are supporting us in every way and let's see what the nature's whispers gonna say and we having make a wish <clears throat> great cards are so beautiful yes make a wish maybe even get the dandelion and blow it your wish away so universe and angels can hear you and wind will take it far away i hope you enjoyed your reading i wish you all the best Please uh, like, subscribe and leave any comments and I see you next time. Bye!